I'm Jack from Jackie View Stuff. Hi, Mike. I'm Jack from Jackie View Stuff, and today I'm reviewing the Dell S twenty seven nineteen H, Dell's only glossy monitor. Yes, Dell may tell you that the S series monitor is glossy. No, only the S twenty seven one nine H has a one percent haze. One percent haze. The others may be. 25% uh, haze or just slightly glossy. Okay, let's go into it. This is a full HD monitor, uh, 1080 by uh, HD, la. 1920 by 1080. 60 hertz refresh rate. What to do? It's a bit slow, but like I said, it's the only one that's glossy that I can find. If you can find a glossier monitor with a higher refresh rate and maybe FreeSync, please let me know in the comments. This knife is the Victoria Knox nail clip because it has nail clipper. Okay, back to the monitor. It's well packaged. In fact, it might even be water resistant. I don't know. I'll curl the packaging. Okay, this monitor has uh, more than 99% sRGB. 99% sRGB is what you're looking for for a video, if for, for editing monitor. Let's check my audio, still going. My audio is from the phone and this. I'm in an echoey room with a noisy car park, so I'm testing out how a nearby lifestyle that dynamic mic sounds. Ugh. This is not heavy, I'm just not very strong. Okay. Oh, that's pretty good. So what do we have? We have the power cables, we have the base, we have I don't know instructions. We don't need we don't need no instructions. Down for this. This is the power cable. Uh, standard power cable. This kind of power cable connector used for your desktop computer and rice cookers, but do not use it for rice cooker or your desktop computer. Why? Because the amperage is different. This monitor is much lower amps than a computer or a rice cooker. Okay? Do not use this for a rice cooker or computer. Monitor is safe. Hey man. Hey, post that true guy. Okay, this is the power transformer. What to say? Uh, 12 volts, 3.3 amps. Eh. What's this? HDMI cable. It comes with the HDMI cable. You need this. Free cables are good. Uh, your old cable, you can throw it away because these cables, they deteriorate. So always use the newer ones. And don't go and buy the cheap one, uh, buy the standard one or decent, Dell is a good brand, they'll give you a decent free cable. The stand. No need screwdriver, use a coin. Or you can use a Swiss army knife. I'm gonna put this, this here for now. Um, <laughs> the hell? Oh. This is a neck. Metal, ah, uh, metal. Plastic on top, metal and rubber. Close up. This is a stand. You use a screwdriver, Phillips or flat or even a coin. It goes this way. Uh, 
Adapter, your shark is in focus. Yeah, good, 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 good. Ah, okay, this is the important part. What you do when you remove a monitor, you pick up the plastic and then you let the box drop. Oh. Yeah, that's how it's done. Now for the base. Hashtag all your bases are belong to us. Uh, don't worry, it's not IKEA, it's just one screw. IKEA is like an IQ test for Swedish people. Oh, you don't even need a screwdriver. This one, I will only do once. The base just locks here. You hook it on. Hook it. Whoa. Uh, gravity. Okay. Damn it. Uh, oh. Is there a screen guard? I can't tell. If there's no screen guard, I'm just gonna break my screen. Okay, look how shiny this is. Oh yeah, glossy. That's why I buy them glossy displays. Okay, let's just stop pissing about. Uh, this slides in here. That's it. Uh, uh, ports. I probably should have done this before I fix the monitor up. You get the idea la, HDMI and power go underneath here. Oh. Do you know what? Okay, power goes under the right side and HDMI goes on the left side. There's two HDMI ports, that's it. No display port, no mini display port, no VGA, no DVI, and no USB C. Uh, this screen doesn't need to be calibrated, but I'll calibrate it anyway. Why did I buy this screen? This is this screen is a 1927. So this is this is a Dell 1927H. I use a 1927. This is a Dell 19, This is a Dell 2719H. I have the Dell 2718H, last year's model. Okay? That was fine. It's just its end of life, EOL. That means Dell is no longer selling it, which means I have to buy the replacement model, which is pretty much exactly the same. 1% haze, glossy screen. Oh yeah, glossy screen. I love glossy screen. 9% uh, sRGB, uh, 60 hertz. So I'm sure I calibrated my old monitor. I calibrated it, it didn't change much. It's pretty much accurate from the factory. I'll calibrate it later. I'm tired. Okay, subscribe. I'm glad I just bought a monitor.